Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another Striker Break. Here we have the Mega Mystery Power Box. Four factory sealed packs, five bonus packs, one bonus baseball collectible, and a guaranteed mystery item, which includes a Mega Box, blasters, tins, and more. What is on the side? Well, is I don't know. I don't know what any of this, uh, you're going to get one of these. Those are nothing. It's advertising 24 SP authentic, like you could potentially get the Griffey Ichiro dual auto. That would be insane, but probably not going to happen. How much did I pay for this thing? Uh, $60. What can you get for $60? Uh, you could get like two flagship blaster boxes, roughly. You could get a blaster box of Topps Chrome and like a hanger box or a hanger box and a fat pack. So let's see if this will beat that out. Oh, look at the wonderful packaging. That's nice. Nice piece of paper protecting everything. Ooh, this is exciting. Okay. We got a full 2021 blaster, man. 2021 stuff, you know, they, they, they got to get rid of it somehow. 2021, the year we all want to forget. And they're going to load you up with Big League. 2023 Big League. At least it's got a decent checklist. We got a Series 1 pack here. That's not too bad. There's some good rookies that come out of there. Uh, Japan Tops Chrome, which I've never opened. But some of these cards do hold some value. 35 mystery cards inside. I bet you that's going to be good. Series 2. 2023 Series 2 couple of those and man do they want to get rid of the big league from 2023 but not 2024 that stuff's quite valuable why striker breaks influencer cards come out of 2024 big league so 2020 so that's like i mean if you see this on the shelf you know extreme value new low price like this thing's going to be probably 15 bucks discounted uh, did we get $60 worth of value? Not even close. You know what? We didn't even get our collectible. There's not even a collectible in here. Hello? Collectible? Ah! Garbage! They ripped us off. And you probably can't return something like that either. Well, at least you know. Let's save this. At least there'll be something in that. How about we rip all the big league, and then we go into this farce. Like, don't buy these if you ever see them. This is trash. But we'll, we'll get into it. How much are these per pack? You may be asking. How much are these packs of big league right here that appear to have come out of a blaster box or something? I don't even know. Like, I would put a value of, like, 50 cents. I don't know. It, they're horrible. Brian Bayo, but we might be able to find something good. Like, a little, little rainbow foil. Brian Bayo, he's a decent pitcher. We're going to keep track of the cards of anything whatsoever that has any kind of value and see what comes of it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for joining me. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Ring the notification bell so you know when I post a new video. Oh boy, that's about as bad as it gets. These packs are stupid too. They're not easy to open. I'm going to spare you and just fly through this stuff because it is about as bad as it gets. This is about as bad as it gets. Like the only thing worse would be like, I don't even know the lowest end Panini, whatever, I guess. I guess that would be worse. This thing right here, whoo, never buy one of these. This collectible. The collectible products in this package has been purchased directly from the manufacturer. Da, 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 da. Okay, thank you. No one cares. We know it's full of junk. What if we magically find one good card? Because I see some 2017. We could get a judge out of here. That'd be nasty. Oh, 
Mother's Day. But back in the day, the Mother's Day was different. It's not what you think. Is that a gold? That's a gold to 2017. Okay, I mean, it's not worth anything, but it is something. Golds are collectible, but not of old man Beltran there. Mm. Oh, a bu bunch of 27. Is that even 2017? Yeah, that is 2017. Carlos Correa. That's a, that's a guy. Ooh, that's a dirty looking card. Ooh. Where was this sitting? Look at this. Ew. Where was that sitting? Yuck. It's okay. Albert Pujols. Not as dirty. A little dirty still. Horrible, guys. Don't do not do it. Don't do it. Did we do anything here? What was going on here? Did we, we got a rainbow foil. Um, okay. I don't know where this came from. Okay. We got quite a stack going. Possible, I guess, 2023 Series 2. I don't even remember who comes out of here, to be honest with you, but we'll figure it out. It's not something I open very often. That's who comes out of here. Josh Young, rookie. Boom, good card pile. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Chrome. Jacob deGrom, Chrome. Uh, yeah, I know what you're saying. Is that going to be a good card pile? It's a Chrome. Stars of MLB, it's something. How about this? Colas? They couldn't give us anything good. There's no way. The ultimate. Not, I think this stuff is probably the ultimate ripoff. Like, if you're thinking about buying any of this MJ Holdings repack garbage, don't do it. No matter what you see on YouTube. Because someone may have just gotten one random box out of a million that has something decent in it, but... Our favorite, Franco. Your favorite, I mean. Not mine, yours. Adley rookie. Best card so far, maybe? Greatest hits, Adley? Eh. Mm. See what I mean? Maybe an auto out of here? Possible. It's possible. Got a, Got some chromes. See if we recognize any of these players. Nope. Nope. Mm -mm. Negative. Negative. No thanks. Chance for an auto out of here. That may be the best thing. This is the best thing. And it's not good. Like, trust. You don't want to be buying 21 archives. When you open these boxes... It will be full of everything you don't want or that you shouldn't buy. And the packs are hard to open. We like watch us. I, I keep saying this, but this is the one thing we could actually get an autograph of a relevant player. Because there's it's not just the checklist. Like there's actually legends that you can get autos of. Is it gonna be rare? Yeah. But it is possible. Hey, there we go. Otani. Oh. Okay. Best card yet. Best card yet. But we should get a parallel out of this. We should get a numbered parallel. If we get numbered Otani, that's cool. Key Brian Hayes rookie. We're, we're just going to put him there. Ken Griffey Jr., relevant player, but some random year Ken Griffey Jr. past his playing days not gonna get it done Bobby Dahlbeck nah hey striker what are you gonna do with all these cards when you're done with them burn them but I want them nope trash into the fire flaming fire flaming burning fire you don't get them the earth gets them.
What a joke. This is such a joke of a release, too. 2021 archives. At the time, Key Brian Hayes. Potential. Maybe a little jazz chisel. I don't know if he's even in the checklist. Like these are the best guys to come out of 21 products besides jazz, but Joe Adele was the, like, remember? We were like, hey, maybe Joe Adele's good. Turns out he's not. Alec Bohm is good though. And Dalton Varsho's okay. That's that's okay. But the base rookie's not gonna get it done. Like we gotta get a parallel out of here. It's possible I passed a numbered parallel and didn't even know it, but. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. That may have been the worst uh, way to spend $60 that I can imagine. Other than entertaining you, there's a little bit of value right there. Make sure you hit the like, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.